the weekend, Allison. What's our work week looking like? What can we expect? Rainy. Rainy, of course. <laughs> Monday morning. <laughs> yeah, Monday morning's looking a little bit rainy for some folks, so let's go ahead and get right into it. But today was absolutely gorgeous. Before that, we do have a very nice picture of the sunset over in uh, Stone, Kentucky. Things are just looking absolutely gorgeous earlier this evening. Just perfect conditions for a gorgeous sunset. And that was sent into one of our Facebook viewers, Tanya. All right, so over to the weather maps we go. We are looking at some rain off towards the southeast. And actually, this rain is going to start to be filtered into our atmosphere over the next 24 hours. So that means rain is on the way. So while we're dry right now in eastern Kentucky, it's not going to stay that way for tomorrow. So yes, a nice clean sweep on pinpoint Doppler. But you can see rain is already starting to filter in towards parts of Tennessee and even parts of Virginia. But temperatures right now, they're a little bit chilly out there. 47 in Jackson, 49 for London, 50, uh, 45 rather for Middlesbrough and 45 over in Wise. Now, over the next couple of hours, we are going to see our temperatures dropping down to the lower 40s. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if we made it down to the upper 30s by around 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. But there is a shower possible. So that does mean that some of the fog could be on the lighter side, but we are still looking at the possibility of some fog forming early in the morning. Now we have a shower possible tomorrow and the rain is going to continue throughout much of your Monday. And then the rain is going to continue throughout much of the week as well. So we do have a bit of a rainy week ahead of us. So I'll go ahead and show you exactly what to expect for tomorrow. So we're going to stay clear tonight. Just a couple of clouds building in earlier towards the morning. And those are going to filter in from the south because that rain is starting to come in from the south. Now, with those clouds in the early morning hours around 7 o'clock, some of our southern counties could start to see some scattered showers throughout the early morning hours. And then by around lunchtime, Pretty much everyone can expect to see a shower. And then throughout the rest of the day, we're also expecting more showers to continue on. Anywhere from about a quarter of an inch to a half an inch possible as far as rainfall totals go. So not a total washout, but definitely some scattered showers. Definitely a day to bring the umbrella or to bring the raincoat. Now on Tuesday, well, we're looking at a couple of showers lingering on throughout the area Tuesday. More cloud cover lingering on as well. But then throughout the e uh, afternoon Tuesday, we will start to see those showers kind of disappear and that cloud cover eventually will disappear because we have a high pressure system coming into play for Tuesday afternoon into Wednesday. But here's those rainfall totals I was talking about anywhere, anywhere from about a quarter of an inch to a half an inch possible over the next 24 hours. Now, as far as tomorrow goes, like I said, rain is possible in the morning, not 100% possible, but there's definitely a chance, especially for our far southeastern counties. Now, throughout the rest of the day, rain is very likely. We have about an 80% chance of rain for tomorrow. So there's a pretty good chance that if you're going outside tomorrow, you're going to run into some rain. Anywhere from about a fourth of an inch to a half an inch possible. And then the rain's going to continue overnight and into Tuesday morning as well. Some lingering showers into Tuesday, but then like I said, things will clear up for just a little bit on Tuesday and then into Wednesday as well. But then Wednesday night, we've got a chance of thunderstorms coming into the area. Possibly even some severe thunderstorms for western Kentucky. We've got a pretty strong cold front that's pushing through the area, which will bring some severe weather further towards our west. As far as eastern Kentucky goes, I think we might luck out as far as the severe weather goes. But Wednesday night, we could be dealing with a thunderstorm. Thursday, just some lingering showers into the morning. And then for the rest of the forecast, things really shape up. And that cold front, it's going to be bringing some pretty strong weather for parts of the United States. And then you can even see the effects of the uh, cold air. You can see 50s for the weekend. So we're looking at a chilly weekend. Yeah, things are really cooling down. Thank you so much, Allison. No problem. I think we'll have a lot of momentum, you know, going into the off season. You know, a, a seven win season and had a lot of success and played tough all year and just really excited. The Cumberland's Patriots season is over despite a 7-3 record. Coming up in sports, hear more from head coach Matt Reimer.